go! We're rolling for the last time before lunch here in this qualification match number 19. Red Alliance already picking up several points. We've got two, uh, okay, we have one for sure out of the half zone. There we go, there's two out of the half zone for red. All three on blue. Revolution almost circled their way out of the habitat zone there during the sandstorm period, but they will remain up on the hab platform until that buzzer goes off. Live score showing 17 to nine, slightly favoring blue here early in the match. Let's see if they're able to keep that momentum rolling. They started with almost entirely cargo preloaded in the center ship before the match. Just one preloaded hatch panel. Let's see if they're able to convert that into points. Uh, which one did I call this one? Victory Mosquito Squad, AKA it's actually a Jack and the Bot team. Dropping off a hatch panel onto the perimeter rocket here in the top right corner of the field and then blinding me with that green light. Okay, we're gonna stand up now. They'll go right back to the human player wall to grab more scoring materials for later in the match. Got some Red Alliance friends over here as well. The Revolution coming over to play some defense here from Red. They wanna block off one of the Jack and Bot teams here from making it over to the bottom right rocket. Jack and the Bot gets sent right back into the habitat zone. They have to go scatter that cargo around, which ends up probably being advantageous later. But really, it's more just their way of getting away from the revolution. The Red Alliance having a slow but steady ability to convert that defense into offensive opportunities. There are no Blue Alliance robots over here on the Red Alliance side of the field. So they got f a free court here for SodaBots to focus on, as the robot says, driving it like you stole it, but really dropping cargo off in that center ship. We've got four cargo bays populated on that red ship. And many hatch panels installed. Jack in the bot. AKA, what did I call those ones? One of the two 99999 teams jumping their way up onto level three. Can we make a double level three happen? We're definitely gonna try the other 999 team. Uh, what was that one? That was the uh, partly cloudy paradox lifting their way up. Doing a little bit of a uh, fingertip push up there to make it up to level three, joining the other 9-9 nine, nine team on level three. That's gonna be a large end game score there for the Blue Alliance. Red Alliance picking up just two level one climbs to end qualification match number 19. Scores are official for qualification match number 19. It's a Blue Alliance victory with a final score New high score for the event, 95 to the Red Alliance's 38. And that's gonna put 9991 up in the first rank position and 9992 just at the tail end of our top eight. As we're a little over halfway through-ish our qualification rounds. Three rank points to each of those Blue Alliance teams. And that's gonna be it for our qual rounds.